maybe I might think of that. Guys. So we would like to invite your listeners to, to come and participate and, and listen. All right. Uh, really like that. Okay. You have a website? Uh, yes, we do. How about, if, okay, here it is. It's HTTP um, slash sites dot Google dot com slash site S I T E. Who made that up? Slash L C F M F S. <laughs> well, let's forget about yeah. the website. Why can't you Google Lancaster County Yes, you could Google uh, Lancaster County Fake Music and Filler Society. That's, a, that, that's more that's language. A yeah. That's a kind of language I understand. <laughs> I'm not with it 100% yet. My daughter called me and said, you're on YouTube. I said, what does YouTube mean? Mother, you've been on it for two years and you don't even know what you're doing. <laughs> That's funny. That is really funny. But I, I'll tell you what, I just got over this round of cameras, so how can I get so excited about all this stuff? I feel like Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs or something. Okay, now what are you going to do next? I, I, I better stop my talking so you get these songs. Okay, in. Patsy's going to introduce her, her song. Oh, listen to it. Amen. I, I, I've been having a heckler since I started this morning. So uh, Patsy's going to do what? Uh, I'll, I'll let her June. introduce. Thank you, Joanne. Uh, we're going to be doing June Apple. A lot of the songs we do are Appalachian or style or traditional music, and this is something called an A-modal song, and uh, I learned it from uh, Kenny Garrett and... and uh, and Nev Jackson, so well, you can't find two better musicians, can you? And Annie Garrett and Nev Jackson, and Bill and Elizabeth are going to join me, and then everybody will be joining me. Again. All right. <laughs>
maybe down your <laughs> way. <laughs> down his way, it takes ten. It takes ten <laughs> down, no, I'm only kidding. No, but it really, uh, you know, a lot of people say, well, I did it myself, I did it my way. You need to help. You right. need to help with your friends. And this is nice. Mm -hmm. I really, I'm enjoying it. So I, I sure will get some response on this. I know that. And uh, all right, what's next? Okay, I think Bill's going to introduce the, this next song. <coughs> this next tune was on the Civil War series on TV, and Jay Unger wrote it. He has a dance in Ashoka, New York, and he went into the woods early in the, wo <coughs> in the morning, and he said, if this was the last year for this dance, how would I be feeling? And this is what he came up with. carried in a gunny sack. <laughs> I like that. I like that. The, uh, the, when you first learned to play, did you learn to play the fiddle before you played any other instrument? Is that was your main? I never played an instrument until I came to the group, the Lancaster County Folk Music, okay. and I heard it was the first time I ever heard anybody playing old-time music. Mm -hmm. And I thought, I don't care how long it takes me, I'm going to learn how to do that. Well, the to get away from the squeakiness of the of the bow, there's an art to that. I mean, did that come easy to you? Did you ever hear the, in New York this guy said, how do you get to uh, Carnegie Hall? And the guy answered him, practice, practice, practice. Is that what it takes? It's just like, you know, I can't believe I did this when I was 10 years old. I learned to play a 120 bass accordion. And I thought, this is taken all the way. I was little at that age. Don't tell me. I mean, don't ask me why. But I learned all my guitar chords from the left side of the accordion. And then I switched over the guitar. It was lighter. But the swing of the accordion came easy to me. So it's either sometimes it'll come easy to you. Sometimes. You know what I mean? And if that comes easy to you, boy, that's great. I don't know anybody that's started the fiddle that's had a really easy time. <laughs> really, <laughs> the fiddle. Yeah. I, I, I can't tell you because it's the only instrument I ever really Oh, I see. Up. Okay. And all right, uh, Lynette. 
My name's Lynette. Lynette, okay. Uh, uh, tell me how you learned to play it. Well, this is a viola, so it's like the alto member of the uh -oh. string family. And I learned, I started taking lessons in third grade in my elementary school when I was part of the orchestra. So I learned how to read music early and then came into folk music after that. That's what I love about music. There's a lot of people that, uh, that play music and have an understanding. Um, I don't like sometimes that they label it too much. You know what I mean? Like, a, oh, you play country and, uh, you know, they'll say he all this night. That's okay. But it's how you present it, I think. Don't you think? Y yes, I do. I love all kinds of music. And, and I think that, uh, I mean, that's all right when we say Appalachian music and stuff like that. But I don't like to put it down on you that, you know, I'm, I don't know if I'm getting it across. <laughs> do you know what I mean? Yeah, yes, yes, I do. Because, you know, when Hank Williams started singing Your Cheating Heart, I mean, he wasn't the greatest singer, but if you take an orchestra or all the instruments here and play Your Cheating Heart, it would be beautiful. Do you know what I mean? Yes. And um, so in my mind, I never had tunnel vision with, uh, with any type of music. I'm so glad that my mom exposed this to a lot of music. And what's sitting on top of your, uh, your banjo? It's a chicken. A chicken. <laughs> I've never seen it. i never seen it. It's chicken. my guard chicken. Your Protect guard chicken. <laughs> oh my goodness. Well, I like to do that. I like to put a chicken on my head. I want a little baby German Shepherd. <laughs> well, I want to say something to Gary. Gary, uh, I won't go off with my theme song. I want to give you a warning. and. Uh, so we'll go off with a, a song. We have time for, I think, one more song, and then we'll go off with a song that you have later on. Uh, what, the circle beam. Let, let's go off with that, but if you want to slip in one more, could we slip in one more? How's our time? Oh, we got three minutes. Well, yes, but I didn't know if you were going to give me something extra or what. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Well, the computer is controlling. Yeah, this will be played back on Tuesday from uh, 3 to 4, right, Gary? Okay. And we are we are live now, but we are taping it. It'll be played back Tuesday, July what? Today is the 10th. Sunday is 11. <laughs> 13th. The 13th. <laughs> oh, I got there, didn't I? If I don't stop talking, I won't get there at all. Well, thank you, uh, Dave. Uh, you know why I want to call you uh, Kirby, because he was on our record stage. And thank you so much. And uh, I do appreciate you, everyone, taking the time, being away from your families today. But this is all worthwhile, isn't it? Yes. And uh, Dave, uh, if you have some uh, towers you want to play in, we'll Okay, I think Ray's going to sing, Will the Circle Be Unbroken? And everyone's going to join in. Will the circle be unbroken by and